Hello, I'm Karen Ridges from Veggie Vision TV and today I'm going to be sharing a healthy eating tip with you. I'm going to show you how to freeze potatoes. Maybe you've picked up a huge bag from a local farmer's market or you've just got an abundance um, of potatoes and you need to know what to do with them. Well, you can actually freeze potatoes. What we've done with these, just to show you, I've already peeled them um, and the best way is to just slice them up into really small, really small pieces. And then what we're going to do, we're going to blanch them for a couple of minutes. It's very easy to freeze potatoes and they can keep a really long time, many, many months in your freezer. Start with some nice potatoes, not ones that, you know, don't look as though they're going to last because freezing them will preserve how long they last for, but it doesn't, of course, increase um, how fresh they are or how nice they were before you froze them. So just in little pieces, tiny little pieces I find work best and then we're going to pop these over to a pan of boiling water You can add salt to the water as well, however I find it just tastes just as fine just using water on its own. And we're going to literally pop these into blanch for about three minutes. So our potatoes have been blanching now for about four minutes. And that really is long enough. So we don't want to overcook them because then they will turn mashy and they lose some of their flavour. So what we do is we need to cool them quickly, so we pop into ice water. You can run this under a cold tap as well if you, uh, if you don't have any ice water, but I do find that the ice water works best. Now you leave these in the ice water really for as long as you blanch them for. So these potatoes now have been cooling for about four minutes. So we're going to pop them out. Now I do find that it's best to leave potatoes just to dry naturally, maybe on a plate or on this work surface, um, for a few minutes. However, you can dry them on a tea towel, on a clean tea towel, or on some uh, kitchen roll. But um, I, I don't advise it. I think it's nice to just leave them on the side. Just takes a bit of time to obviously avoid picking up the ice. Oops. You can just leave this, leave your potatoes to dry for just literally let the air blow over them for about one minute. Okay, so literally you've blanched your potatoes, you've popped them in and they've boiled just for a few minutes and then we're just going to pop them into a freezer bag. It's probably best to just do it a little bit of a at a time because it, it, it is a bit fiddly. Get the air out of the bag and just simply roll them over. You can write the date on these bags or stick a, a little sticky note over if you need to know um, when you froze them. And that really is it. You just need to pop them in the freezer. So that is how you can freeze potatoes.